that's good. Hey, and welcome back to the Drifters, and um, we're just chilling, or I'm just chilling at least right now because the controls I've have passed over to me. Had a very long week, and it feels late. Like the the rain it clouds does. are it over. It feels really late. Everything gets darker sooner, and so now I'm just like it feels like eleven o'clock. But I look over at the clock, and it's, it's like seven thirty. So, look at my best friends. They're chilling. Let's see what they're doing. Look at my best friends. <coughs> Ooh, what if they catch them? Maybe they'll eat them. Then they'll have contracted light bug itis. Oh, I'm gosh. sorry. Look Just... up. <laughs> Is he wearing a gold chain? Oh no, that's no, a drawstring. That's, yeah, that's a drawstring. I want a onesie like that. It's not only looking scarier now; it sounds awful too. <laughs> Ooh. Well, I don't think it's... They just need to shove some head and shoulders up it. <laughs> in fact, I think it's inviting us to do just the opposite. Whatever that is, yeah. Shove shampoo up that hole. It feels, oh, like, it's, feels like it's watching us, biding its time while it grows in power. All the more reason to get to Mr. Tom Pan as quickly as possible. <laughs> Looks like books. Like, it just reminds me of the. I want to say Lore Master, but that's not what that movie was called. It was called. It wasn't as simple as the Book Master, was it? The Page Master. Page Master. I was like, it's something mass. Something. Insert insert book term here. <laughs> insert something that has to do with books and tomes here. Master. That's one of my favorite movies. That movie was so good. There's a long list of movies that have like sprung up in my head that I wanted to rewatch for concepts to kind of help me write my own stories mm -hmm. and also formulate other um, ideas and like D and D campaigns and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. So the Page Master was one of them. Um, the Sandman like. Chronicles by Neil Gaiman has been another one of them. And then um, The Imaginarium of Dr. Parnassus was another one. And I was actually really annoyed that I was able to watch it on, I th I'm pretty sure it was Netflix mm -hmm. for a while. And then they just took it off. Like, I was, I totally forgot that. No, I, I'm willing to say it. I was unaware that Netflix had, a, like, a rotation thing going on. Oh, yeah. I thought they were just, like, slowly, like, adding titles. But I guess they only have so much storage space in their, like, cloud or whatever they're using. So they're like, okay, our contract's going to be up with these, you know, with these titles. So we're going to switch them out with these titles, is what I'm assuming they're doing. But I was super annoyed at finding that out because... The Imaginarium is was a it was a well done film, in my opinion. I didn't get a chance to watch it. It was on my life list forever. I think I think I'm willing to go as far as to say that the ending was a little sloppy, but that's because they had an actor die in the oh, middle wow. in the middle of it. So um, It wasn't my choice. Well, I think it was going to end the way that it ends. It was always going to be that way, but I still think that it was, it was nice, it was sweet, but I thought it could have been done better, I guess. I guess everything can be done better, but, you know, because it's one of those endings where it's kind of, there's, there's aspects of it that are open to a, interpretation. Oh, okay. Like... Um, you know, like, is this really the way this is, or is this, you know, is this like a different thing, or are these people really this way? Um, even now that I say it out loud, I'm not happy with that. <laughs> I'm not happy with that, that <laughs> analysis, but I'm going to stick to it because, uh, I want to talk about other things. <laughs> You know, one of the other things that I've been considering sticking in that maybe pile to do have been like reviews of things, so like movie reviews, um, tech reviews, game reviews, 
Um, the only reason why I don't already do those things is because they require like actual thought in the writing that goes into them because you're technically writing an argument you yeah. know here is why i think this thing is a three star is a five star whatever system you want to use it's a thumbs up it's a thumbs down you know so that has so that writing has to be very solid you know has to be a very solid argument as to why you think that way and that requires thought and time and I haven't found a nice workflow that allows me allows to really your... sit down and, you know, draft out, like, something that I would consider a well-thought argument. <laughs> um, and the same goes with tech reviews and even, like, food reviews and stuff like that, you know? Because like, then I have, to, I have to consider, like, what are my criteria? Yeah. Um, why do I think that it's that way? But if I put them in the maybe pile, then, you know, I can always just kind of have that bookmark in there as far as like, uh oh, Tyler drew this on, you know, May 29th, so he's got to do it eventually. And yeah, so also, uh, I guess I should take the time to just kind of put it out there that um, my goal <coughs> to try to implement that aspect to this channel is... Um, the end of what? February, right? Mm -hmm. The end of February. So if I, if you don't see anything from the maybe pile in March, <laughs> then um, <coughs> I'm not doing my job. <laughs> He's not doing his job. Please. Whatever, whatever freeloading job this is currently. All right, so what enemies are you looking at? You're looking at three, three shield people. Three Valkyries. They have guns now? They've always had guns. No, they didn't. Yeah, they did. They just smashed you with pianos. No, they didn't. These are different people. Oh. Why can't we all just be one people? Why do we always have to have these divisions? Look. Here, these Tyler. guys, ha these guys are shield people. These guys <laughs> are, you know, these guys are piano people. You switched up. Why would you put? We we haven't <coughs> used Rabbit Mario, like ever. <laughs> Yeah, he also has vampire. Yeah, but I, I don't know. I feel like one person with vampires enough eh. to just infect all of them, and then the other two can just sort of piggy bank off of that, piggy back, piggy back off of that, piggy back off of that. Let's see, that's probably the 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 better. The better aspect of Mario, rather Mario. Those Valkyrie rabbits look like something out of Kingdom Hearts or Spiral Knights. I was thinking more of Kingdom Hearts ish. Yeah. yeah. Burn, baby, burn. Disco is burn. Oh, ooh, nice combo. See, now that I'm not playing, the game feels, or like time seems to be moving a lot faster. <coughs> it's already been like 10 minutes. <laughs> Alrighty. They look so comfortable. They're the, God damn. They're, the, they're the comfy bros. Did he amplify that through his shield or did he just shoot it? No, he, uh, the one guy boosted this. Oh, okay. Uh, he holds it on top of his shield. Yeah. I thought he uses the fan. Uh, it used to be a fan in the ice area. Yeah. I thought he put it into that hole and he shoots it through so the shield, like, amplifies his shot. But that's not true with these shields. Yeah, collect those coins that we don't ever use. Yeah, dude. How do you think I'll buy new weapons? Well, you may use them off camera, but we don't use them at all. Yeah. 
<laughs> so <laughs> I hear you like Valkyrieing. <laughs> So, uh, you a Valkyrie? I can, uh, I can help you with that. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. I think of all of the military titles, I think Valkyrie sounds the coolest. I'm trying to think of the other ones, though, because, like, the... Because, <coughs> like, there's... Like, the title, like, a, you know, the, the Spartan Warrior. Like, it's like, okay, but... <laughs> Do they have a cool Y in their name? <laughs> um... Uh... I don't know if that's their weapon or if that's also the name of their unit, but the mm. the, the Gukris? Mm. Ooh, damn. Is Mario dead? Not that one. Uh. <laughs> Alrighty. So this is what we're gonna do guys. Yeah, anyways, those guys have those guys have a cool name and a really cool and, it, and they've created a really cool dagger for it, too. I guess it's considered a short sword at some points? Because it can be, like, various lengths. The Kukri. Hiya. Hiya. Whoa, what was that? He has an explosive dash. Well, so does everyone else who goes to Taco Bell. <laughs> Nice! Wow. <coughs> if only you had played pool better and you knocked all of them into the pockets. That would have been like... The bee's knees. Peace de resistance. Um, to be fair though, I feel like Taco Bell gets a lot of flack. I, like I actually Bell. really like... <laughs> But I consider my stomach to be a lot more stubborn than a lot of other people's. Like everyone in my college dorms, they'd be like, "Uh, you're gonna you're gonna go get Taco Bell." I don't think so. And I was like, "Why? What's the problem?" With it? <laughs> they're like, "Because my stomach doesn't agree with it." And I was well, like, "Well, that's because your, your stomach is weak. A bitch. Exactly. <laughs> you need to drink more tequila." <laughs> <laughs> I think I think vodka is to apples as tequila is to tomatoes. Que, que pasa? <laughs> <laughs> How did you come to that? Well, because they're both a liquor, right? So they're both a red. I mean, some would argue a fruit, but you know they're both red. They're both a red food. But one is like one's considered to be a <coughs> lot more sweeter than the other one but one has more like health benefits than the other one that is true Ooh, these guys are both <laughs> he gives up <laughs> don't tase me bro my bad say hello to your grandma <laughs> I need to start abusing the theater silhouette that we that I got going on. I'm gonna start wearing funny hats. You should. But I need to find funny hats. <laughs> when I was in Japan I used to have this um I used to have this like Horus and Bastet head that you can um, print out and mm. like paste together. And I used to wear that around to just like screw with my neighbors because they would always like peer in through and I'd just be this you weird see how silhouette. Easy that was? I thought there were like two other people you had to kill. I don't know. Just... Look at how much look at how much health Mario took. Yeah, but look at the health that they have. They could have been Yoshi would have taken care of them like that. Oh really? I think so. Really? Uh, Mister, I take an extra turn and lose Yeah, my well, lose my you know people. what? We'll figure out that on the next episode. We will. So um, tune in and you'll find out 
in the argument of DVT. This one's like a mouse. I actually don't even know what we're really arguing about. We're not. Is arguing. this really an argument? No, I'm, not really. I'm over it. See, you're already over it. I already won. Bye. <laughs>